Hey guys, so Walking Dead is over. That was the season, the mid-season finale, and I am heartbroken <laughs> right now. Okay, so spoilers just right off the bat, there's going to be a lot of them. Uh, they killed Beth, and I'm so, like, I feel all types of ways about this because, like, okay, so I thought we had avoided Beth being killed when we see that Daryl in the last episode was not carrying Beth out the hospital was just carrying some Beth sized body bags and so when they killed her off in this episode it was just so senseless like like they, he's like picking off the Green family I mean first Herschel now like the last one's Maggie and so I'm like okay was Glenn going to get a new girlfriend soon <laughs> because he's like just picking them off and so I was really disappointed because like it was a, I mean, it was a very, very touching scene, you know, I had a feeling, like, I never knew Dawn would be the one to kill her, but that whole episode was really cool, I mean, she just saves Dawn from that other officer, and I almost wonder that if, if Beth never saved Dawn from that other officer, would he, she be still alive, like, okay, that other guy would have killed Dawn, took over, and then he would have been like, you know, he might have, like, hurt her, but... She wouldn't have probably been killed. He probably wouldn't negotiate and let her go because they nobody cared that much. Dawn was a true villain. She was a control freak, and she just wanted to make sure everybody did everything, everything she wanted to do. And when like what drove Beth to the over the edge was when she said, "I knew you'd be back." Like it wasn't even by his choice. I mean, he was not her like her servant or like her property. And when she's like, "He has to come back. He's one of mine." I just like feel like if he hadn't went back so soon, like he, if he had a fought for and not, like he was trying to save everybody by saying, you know, I'm just going to go over. And Beth stabbed from scissors and she just, she just shot her. And I was like, when Daryl started crying, I was like, no, I really wanted him to have a nice reunion with Beth too. And they hug. And one thing kept going through my mind is when Beth's like, you're going to miss me so much when I'm gone. And I was like, no. <laughs> you know, he had to carry her out. And oh my goodness, Maggie's acting was so good. When she was like just crying. When she was so ha I, mean, I felt so bad for her. Like when Michonne told her sister was alive, she was so happy. And like all that happiness to come in there and see no, she was actually, she just missed her. Just missed seeing her sister alive. I'm like, that was heartbreaking. It ain't had to be like that. It did not have to be that way, and I don't know. It was a good mid-season finale, of course. It's always a good episode, but I don't know. Tell me in the comments what y'all think. Would you have, uh, do you think Beth was a good one to kill? I feel like you don't have to keep killing, like, I know you want to make it look realistic, but, like, it's not realistic for Rick to constantly get out of bad situations. I mean, like, why him? Shouldn't the laws of chaos have been killed, Rick? So... That's not realistic, you know, <laughs> Rick should be killed, like, he shouldn't be the one always swiggling out of situations, but, like, he still does, and the baby is completely unrealistic, I mean, they should have been ran out of milk and carnation and all that stuff, so, it's no reason to keep killing characters, I kind of wish The Walking Dead was one of those shows where you kind of, like, know the character's gonna be always alive, or, like, it's not, it's gonna be really rare for a character to die, so, I don't know, kind of wish it was Eugene, <laughs> so... <laughs> That's basically it. I don't, I don't want to make this a long review. It just, I don't know. I would, it would have been a better one if they all had have escaped, in my opinion. But I know it's got to be the Walking Dead. This is what makes the drama, what makes the, the feels and the pain. So tell me in the comments what y'all think. Did you like that Beth was killed? I mean, nobody likes it, but did you agree with it? Or would you have preferred it to be, uh... Not that way. Okay, and if you like what I do, don't forget to subscribe. Also, I'm an author. Please check out my book in the link below. I write scary stories and fantasy stories. And um, I'll talk to y'all later, hopefully soon, because I'll be doing a couple of other reviews. Okay, guys. Bye.